Okay, hello, welcome. We're at Embedded World here, and I'm in the DFI booth, booth 2631, and I'm here with my old friend, Charlie Yang, Vice President of DFI. And so, Charlie, welcome to the show. Yeah, that's my pleasure to be here. So when I think of DFI, I think of smart cities, smart factories, smart transportation, and you've got a couple really cool demos that I'd like to show off here. And before we get started, we should also know that DFI is over 40 years old and one of the top three IPC manufacturers in the world, so congrats on that. Yep. So let's dig into the demos here. Sure. Okay, so in this section is our smart city demonstration. Um, in the left-hand side you see here it's called the smart pole. And here you see the two main uh, IP65 uh, system. One is panel PC, another is a box PC. Because we all know that city not only indoor but also outdoor. Yeah. So this type of uh, edge computing um, needs to be put on outdoor. We need to be waterproof, dustproof. So this is why we can provide the solution to our customer. And uh, if you move a little bit in the middle, here is our backend system. Because as you know, no man car is all over the world uh, in the future. So the, we need to have a back end to control, to check, to monitor those vehicles will be safe on the road. Mm -hmm. So we see here is a attack button. This is not some bad guy will hijack your car. <laughs> Physically, they might hijack your car from the internet. Yeah. So the, this back end will see if the attack is truly happen, then the, they can the, have some software to prevent this kind of a hijack from the other the, uh, bad people. So that's pretty much about our small, smart city and the smart uh, transportation in this section. Any question? Okay, I'm back with Charlie and we're in another demo inside of the DFI booth here at Embedded World. And today we're talking about industrial, industrial pie. This is really cool, something that our, our readers are really going to find interesting. Yeah. So it's based on AMD. Yes. Run us through it, tell us what's, what it's all about. Okay, yeah, so here you see the, uh, uh, it probably not the smallest computer in the world, but very close to that. It's a 1.8 inches uh, uh, board with the AMD R2000 uh, solution. Uh, we all know that all the electronic devices is getting smaller and smaller, except the one with the LCD display. But this one, we don't have that. Um, it's a very small with a DIN rail uh, that which can put uh, in the in, uh, factory automation. Yeah. And uh, because of this uh, small size, it can be very sa uh, space saving solution to a lot of customers who need a, a small PC. And, uh, but will not be seen by the too many the, uh, outsiders. So this is a very cute um, uh, system, and right right now it's a, a patent protection protected now. Great, and obviously people can go to DFI.com and see more about this. Yes, absolutely, DFI.com. Is we have a Qualcomm board, and this is pretty new and built for mobile. So yep. let us know a little bit more about this. Sure, absolutely. Uh, the thing unique here is uh, most of our platform is made by Intel or, or AMD or the, uh, NXP. But this Qualcomm solution is that uh, we just demonstrated uh, in this booth this year. And uh, the, the unique part of this one is that uh, we are trying to attract some of the mobile uh, customer who like to de uh, develop a mobile product with us. And uh, something that uh, interesting is this power is like uh, Intel i3 or i5 solution. Okay. So it's very uh, uh, performance oriented. Not like uh, your the handset uh, is not that much uh, uh, high performance. So the, looking forward to have some customer who like to work with DFI on this uh, Qualcomm platform. Great, okay, yeah. thanks Charlie. Yeah. All right, Charlie, well this is our last demo. We actually have two that I'm excited about. One, we're talking about smart factory and machine vision. So yeah. tell us what you got going on here. All right, so uh, we all know that the smart factory is uh, getting more and more important because uh, uh, labor shortage and uh, things and the like. We need to be automated our factory. And so when we see here, what DFI can provide it is the uh, first one here is for the machine vision. Because as you know, to check by visual eyes for this component is very, very difficult. So we all need to have this kind of uh, uh, computing uh, engine to the, uh, check the, the parts or even the pr product in detail by the program. So this is the um, main board solution that DFI can provide it for our customer. Yep, and that's based on the Intel yes, chip? Yes, this is based on the latest uh, Intel chip. So what do we got going here? This <laughs> really piqued my interest, this autonomous robot. Yeah, uh, especially for a small boot that we have to put in this uh, big unit here, it's kind of uh, hard, but the reason why we put that here is because uh, this autonomous car, or 
inside is using our refineless system. And that system that make a very powerful uh, control unit uh, as an engine for our the customer to design the autonomous car like this. So the, that's what DFI provided right now. And so does this clean the booth at night when you leave? <laughs> <laughs> well, I hope that he can do that, but so far it's not, <laughs> not yet. <laughs> Well, again, hey, Charlie, always yeah. great to see you. Yeah, and good then, to see you. Uh, make sure to visit DFI.com for yeah. more about their smart factory, smart transportation, uh, all of your needs. Yeah. So, Thank you so yeah. much.